Hey, what is up you guys? So it is just about five days away from June. It is 49 degrees outside and sprinkling. I think we're in some type of reverse never ending global warming or something. But anyway, we're just gonna have to brute force our way into the mountains this year. The goal for today is to make our way up to a lake at about 3,500 feet. This is a lake I've never been to. As far as I know, there's no trail. Uh, I don't even know if the lake will be frozen over with snow on it still. I don't even know if there's fish in there. So it sounds like we're going on a little bit of an adventure today, but first we got to drive down the bumpiest road in the whole world. Oh, sweet mother of God. <laughs> Jeez Louise. No avoiding these potholes. Here we are, almost June, stomping through several feet of snow. All right, obviously we are this little blue triangle here, and we're gonna play a game called Just the Tip, and we are gonna head out to the end of this very phallic looking four service road here, and then we're gonna jump off the road and head up to this lake here. There might be a pretty gnarly creek crossing right in the middle, we'll see how that goes. Overall, it's about a mile and maybe about 800 feet of elevation gain. Let's hit it. Whew, walking through the snow is kicking my ass. All right, we're leaving the safety of this road. Uh, I've actually been following a set of tracks. I don't know if you guys can really see them in the snow there. They are not human. Uh, my guess is that it's a bobcat. Uh, they don't mind the snow so much, but there's not much food out here right now for a mountain lion or a bear. Anyway, we're headed up there. So, doesn't look too bad on camera, but uh, in person it looks pretty gnarly. Let's go see about this creek crossing. Yeah, buddy, we're about three quarters of the way up this hill here. Uh, it's coming down real hard right now, so I'm taking a shelter under this giant tree here. It's totally bone dry under here, but man, these are some wild conditions, you guys. Super, super gnarly and dangerous. It's uh, pouring rain right now. We're way out in the mountains, no trail, definitely no people, don't want to get wet. Yeah, snow, rain, but hopefully this thing will pass us by here in a minute and we can make it up. I think I can start to see the crest of the slope. All right, rain, time to give it up, bud. Okay, I had to uh, brave the rain. Uh, see, I'm getting a little cliffed out over here and a little cliffed out on the other side. My options are out in the open, in the snow, steep, steep slide down there in the rain, or head up this little chute into the trees. Take my chances, maybe we could stay dry. Oh, camp rubber. So this is going from uh, wild to absolutely nuts here. I'm up on this ridge in a uh, complete whiteout. The lake is, let's see, just about right in front of you guys, but I'm all cliffed out down here. And so in this whiteout, I'm trying to stay up on this ridge because, uh, yeah, I don't need to fall down there. 
So I haven't quite bit off more than I can chew yet, but uh, I definitely am taking a bigger bite than I thought I was gonna. My biggest fear is that we'll get down to the lake and it'll be totally covered in ice and snow, no water accessible. Then I gotta hike out. <laughs> Let's find this gosh damn lake. Clear up, man, the weather guy said it was gonna clear up, so yeah. Clear up, I wanna be able to see this gosh dang place I'm at. Whew, this is nuts. That's nuts. Oh, finally, some open ground that I can actually move in that isn't like trying to kill me on any given side. So I'm looking right at the lake right now. I think I can just see a little opening. Uh, I can't tell if there's water or not. Fingers crossed, you guys. Fingers crossed. What? I am so far out in the woods right now. Every time I see one of these, it absolutely creeps me out, and I'm not sure why. I believe it's just a snow depth measuring station, but you just like come out of the woods and all of a sudden there's this like giant man-made thing. It's, it just weirds me out. Anyway, lake's over here. There's actually some clearing up there. I still can't tell. Well, I made it to the lake. Huh. What? That turned into like an insane adventure blog or something. Wasn't quite what I was going for, but we'll see what happens. So what do you guys think? Is there water or not? You got about three seconds to decide. Well, there it is. The lake. <laughs> oh my God, what a trek just to get up to see a snowy field here. It doesn't look like it would be that big of a lake. I'm not even sure if fish would be in there. Um, uh, if there was no snow, I don't know. I just can't tell how deep it is or anything from here. So I think we're going to have to come back to this spot, uh, when, when the snow clears up and check it out. Uh, at least there's no mosquitoes. Gosh, dang you guys. I just literally days, we are days away from June. We're only at 3,500 feet. We're not that... We're not that high in elevation. Also, this is like a pretty exposed spot. We're not deep down in a bowl or anything. Yeah, this should be melting off. What a what a crazy year. Oh, I am wicked hungry. Let's say goodbye to the to the lake there. Uh we'll come back at some point. Maybe maybe next year when uh when all this snow melts. Anyway, let's go find somewhere down in the trees. I gotta eat something. I am definitely not taking the same way back that we came in. All right, let's go grab a snack. Woo, beautiful spot though. What an adventure so far. Uh, I brought my winter load out, I mean, which is a good thing, but definitely heavier than my, than my summer stuff. I don't wanna let my, <laughs> it's a really, it's like straight down right in front of me. Uh, I don't wanna drop my backpack, it'd be, it'd be bye-bye. Let's have a big ass cookie. So yeah, it's been really tough getting out. Um, at this rate, I honestly think it might be like July before I can actually do any like actual backpacking and fishing. Um, there's still like six feet of snow out here. We're only at 3,500 feet. Um, so over the next couple weeks, we're gonna have to figure out some different videos to do. I didn't really put out any videos in May just cause I haven't been able to do much, but uh, we'll figure it out. We'll figure out some uh, some lowland stuff. But, uh, all right, I'm gonna have this cookie. My butt's gonna freeze off, sitting on the snow, and uh, then we're gonna head down this cliff. Well, this really looks like something Coleman would fall down. If you guys wanna see Coleman fall down a cliff on a backpacking trip, click up here, or up here. Click up here somewhere. All right. Well, no camp, no fish, no lake whatsoever, but uh, we're still having a better day than this dude. <laughs> There's some free tires if you need them. Anyway, uh, what a wild adventure. I'm gonna go home and uh, dry off. So thanks for watching you guys. I will catch you on the next one.